first and foremost, we've been uh, very successful, as I've said, um, in positioning Ghana as a peaceful, stable, democratic country uh, within which there's a clear legal and regulatory framework within which you can invest. Uh, historically, from a political perspective, we've transitioned from one political dispensation to another. Um, and those are things that are extremely important for the business community when they're thinking about investing. Uh, so really, that image and the way we projected that image uh, has been one of those things that has attracted a lot of interest from the business community. Uh, I think, again, uh, the experience that we're creating for the business community, both domestically and internationally, in that when they come into the country, they know that there's a first point of contact, and it's contact that's credible uh, when they're looking at investment opportunities, creating the right framework in terms of the quality and the quantity of information that's available to the business community in a format that makes sense, uh, ensuring that they are aware of a broad suite of services that we as an investment promotion center can make available to them so they don't feel like they're going into this space without really knowing who they need to engage with what the legal requirements are, what the processes and procedures are, who they need to meet with. Those are all things that, as an investment promotion agency, we offer those services. So it's about creating the right sort of experience for the investor. And I think, finally, it's about the kinds of results that we're able to deliver. Um, because we're looking at investments that will translate into development, we're being very clear as a country. Uh, about our focused target areas. So as I mentioned, power, for instance, I mentioned in infrastructure, I've talked about agriculture, the tourism sector, real estate. Uh, but we want to make sure that those investments translate into development. What is development? It's jobs, it's skills transfer, it's technology applications that are new to our space, it's promoting joint venture partnerships so that the excellence in, in the corporate environment that we have in Ghana is properly showcased to the international business community. Uh, all of those things come together uh, to deliver specific results, results that allow us as a country to know that we are creating jobs, uh, society is improving and progressing, but for the business community, they're also meeting their commercial requirements. And so uh, the image, the experience, and the results, I think, are what are defining Ghana as this premium place to start doing business.